Kourtney Kardashian became pregnant in December 2009 with her first child, son Mason Dash Disick. After announcing her pregnancy Courtney appeared on the cover of Us Weekly magazine wearing a pink bikini and showed off her baby bump proudly. But then, during the early months of her pregnancy, she suffered severe morning sickness and was even hospitalized due to dehydration. She also had to restrict her workload to deal with her nausea. Despite the difficulties, Courtney continued to be optimistic and share her progress on social media. On 8 July 2010 Courtney gave birth to her son Mason in Los Angeles. Several days later Courtney shared the news of his birth on her website, as well as photos of her and her newborn son. Following Mason's birth, the new mom faced a series of medical complications including postpartum depression. Courtney's depression was treated with medication and counseling and she slowly started to feel better. Courtney has since spoken out about the experience and urged other moms who may be struggling to seek help. She also documented her pregnancy journey in the e. reality series Keeping Up With The Kardashians. Courtney and her partner, Scott Disick, later had two more children, daughter Penelope Scotland Disick and son Rain Aston Disick. In April 2017, Courtney announced that she was expecting her fourth child with boyfriend Yoon Benjima. The couple decided to keep the gender of the baby a surprise until the birth. Unfortunately, the pregnancy was cut short in August when Courtney suffered a miscarriage. In the weeks following the miscarriage, Courtney was comforted by her family and friends. She also talked publicly about her experience in order to encourage other women who had gone through similar tragedies. Courtney took to her Instagram account to share an emotional post about her miscarriage with her followers. She opened up about what she had gone through and asked her followers to send her their positive thoughts. Courtney later wrote a blog post on her website, expressing her gratitude for the love and support she had received. Despite the difficulties, Courtney was still able to find the strength to stay positive and focus on what matters the most. She shared her story to remind other women that they are not alone and that talking about their struggles can be healing. In October 2017, Courtney opened up even more about her miscarriage in an interview on the Today Show. She revealed that it was a difficult but ultimately liberating experience and that she found comfort in talking about her pain. Courtney also made it clear that she was open to having more children in the future.